Uh, we can smell the, the good food being cooked in the studio right now, but since we're talking about food and healthy food, let's talk about exercise and how you can maintain a good, healthy weight. And for that, we've got uh, Hector Gutierrez Jr. and Brent uh, Norman. Both are from Corpus Christi. Both have a, a new place that just opened up. Tell us about this, this place where you can go and exercise and learn how to be healthy by exercising? Uh, well, my studio is located off of uh, Waldridge and Cimarron. Um, I'm next to a martial arts uh, facility. Um, I'm at 1,100 square foot and I primarily uh, focus on kettlebell training. Um, a kettlebell goes back over 300 years, uh, some even say to the Greeks over thousands of years ago. But 1,700 years ago, uh, essentially looks like a cannonball with a handle attached to it. Um, it's, an, it's got an offset center of gravity, so that's, that's the tool of choice that we use to help people move more functionally the way our bodies are meant to move. Our, our bodies are meant to move in a primal manner. Um, so a kettlebell helps promote flexibility, mobility, uh, strength and endurance all in one one small package. So that, that's what we focus that's what we focus on at the at the Heartstyle Kettlebell Club. And, and this is a, a, a a machine, right? I mean, no. This is a, it's a tool. We're going to do a small demonstration. You'll get to kind of see what it looks like. Uh, but uh, they range in all sizes, from 10 pounds up to the 106 pound beast. So they um, in each, you know. It's efficiency, I guess to put it in a small, broad way would be efficiency. Um, it's, 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 it's a tool. It's not a, it's not a machine. It's, not a, it's nothing that's going to restrict your movement. It's going to help develop, promote better movement patterns. And strength? Strength, uh, strength training. Um, it, it can be used as a conventional weight, uh, but the purpose of the kettlebell is to use it in a ballistic fashion, um, which it uh, promotes um, more force production, um, helps with better posture, um, helps promote um, uh, post the posterior chain, your your glutes and your quads and your hamstrings. So, um, basically, it help us move more more properly. Now, how long is a routine for? A routine. I mean, you can do a routine in 11 minutes. I mean, you can get a good workout in 11 minutes. Usually, what we do is 30 minute sessions. Um, it's enough. I promise. Sure. Yeah, you'll you'll get a you'll get a good one. And, and you feel you feel the difference on the first time and, you do it. And the benefit of the kettlebell is that our, as a human, with the way we're we're made to perform is, you see a lot of people they do oh, with today's leg day and today's arm day. Well, your body's not meant to move one body part at a time. You're supposed to train your body as one efficient unit. A football player when he goes and plays football doesn't just use his arms to tackle somebody. Right. He needs full full body movement, full force production, and proper movement patterns. And that's everything that the kettlebell teaches. So we've got uh, an example here. We're going to see something? Absolutely. All right, how do we set that up? Um, I can just bring them right around. Okay, bring it over here. Show it to us real quick. Uh, tell us a little bit about how this all works, though, while, while uh, Hector's getting this ready. Uh, the kettlebells? Yeah. Uh, yeah, the kettlebells. Um, pretty much what you're going to be using is there's four huge muscle groups in your body. It's your, called your lats, your quads, your glutes, and your abs. Um, you you want to keep those tight pretty much throughout the movement. Um, other stabilizing muscle groups are going to help move those four and all together, you're going to use your whole body. So it's going to, the more uh, muscle groups in your body that you're going to use, the more calories you're going to burn, uh, the more efficient the exercise is going to be. That's why I said 11 minutes, that's all you need. So this is available over at your place, and the, the, the Hector's, and, and, and you're one of the trainers as well. How do we get involved, and, and where do we go to learn more about this? Uh, we're going to have our information up on the board. You just give us a call, and we uh, set up by appointment. And uh, we usually have either one-on-ones, uh, groups of four, and uh, even larger groups than that. These are interesting. These are not your typical weights that, that we see, you know, uh, at, at different uh, places here in town. This is very different, isn't it? No, sir. Yeah, we, we, this is. This is a kettlebell. Essentially, looks like a weight with a handle on it. Now, what separates this for something, let's say a dumbbell, is that a dumbbell actually the weight sits in your hand. So, with a kettlebell, as you can see, that's got an offset center of gravity here. The bell actually sits away from the handle, which promotes more stability. Your body has to engage fully in order to properly move, accelerate, and decelerate the bell, which we're going to show here in just a moment. Go ahead. Let's let's do that. Like a, a typical routine would be what? Um, well, we're about to show you. You want to show me? Yes, sir. Um, well, we're just going to uh, need to set up real quick, and then we're both going to go ahead and go through the movements uh, for you all. First thing we're going to do is uh, just a basic kettlebell swing. Okay, basic kettlebell swing is a full body exercise. Okay, so I'll demonstrate a swing, and then I'm going to come down for what we call a goblet squat, which is a mobility drill. Okay. That's, this so is what I'm, I'm going to hinge back. Instead of squatting, I'm going to hinge myself back, keep my eyes on the horizon, and I'm going to do... 10 swings, and then I'm going to bring it up for a goblet squat. And 
then that's the swing okay and then the mobility drill opening my hips promoting inner thighs it's nice straight spine tall posture then I'm from here to go deeper you could do a bicep curl takes your body deeper into the posture then you come up you guys if you want to learn more all you have to do is call and go where uh, the Hardstyle Kettlebell Club uh, at uh, 6313 Wooldridge Road, Suite Number 9. And uh, you can call me, myself, Hector, 361-442-4232. Call Brent. Either one of you guys just show up at your place, right? Absolutely. Thank you guys for coming. We appreciate this. I